Hello, YouTube, and welcome back. Today's project is trying to get this landscaping equipment safely on this trailer so it can travel without falling apart. Stick around. As a disclaimer, we are not carpenters, we are not engineers, and we don't know what we're doing. So try this at your own risk. So we got a 6x12 trailer. We got one Proline 48 inch cut made by Toro and one small trim mower. We're going to get everything on here, put a couple of tie downs on it. Make it able to travel. All right, this stuff we're using one pack of Husky 16 foot one and a quarter inch ratchet strap tie downs good to 1,000 pounds per strap they had 500 pound ones but I figured hey go for the gusto couple of lag screws I think these are mild steel grade 5 and husky light duty stainless anchor points good for 600 pounds each so yeah it should be good enough you know you get four of them on there what's what six times four 2,400 pounds. Thank you. Here's the plan. We're going to put a D-ring on one side, run the strap over the top, D-ring on the other side, and that should hold this whole thing in place because, number one, it weighs about 600 pounds. Number two, it's got a chuck on the back wheels already for a brake so it doesn't roll. And number three, we're hoping for the best. Feel free to get in the comment section down there and tell us how wrong we are and unsafe. Stick around. And voila! Machine is strapped down, it's on the front, loaded 60-40 on the weight. I think I'm going to take most of this strap and cut it off so it's not just dangling everywhere because this is going to be special purpose for this tie down on here and they're only five bucks a piece so you ain't losing too much. Next up, the trim mower. Where's it going to go? You want to put it on the side or do you want to put the wheels toward the toward the rail we're gonna look it over I'll be back so here's the plan put the front wheel up against the big mower that's already strapped down so it's not gonna move forward and we'll put a d-ring on each side of it back here put the strap on it might tighten it down just perfect <laughs> Tech tip, setting up the ratchet strap. Okay, so what you wanna do is, you wanna go through the bottom of the V, straight through that slot there, come out the other side at the bottom, and make sure you're pulling the loose end to the opposite side of the strap that's already attached. And pull it through and it shouldn't get tangled. And make sure you're doing it in the rain. Okay, we got them both strapped down pretty good. Now here's a tip for you. This had to be on the right side. When we tried to do it on that side, we couldn't crank it because of the frame rail. So keep that in mind. And she's secure. I feel pretty comfortable with that. And there you have it. Putting in some D-rings, strapping down some lawn equipment, making sure it's safe to go down the road or safe-ish. I appreciate you watching. Thanks for being here. Hit that like button and keep watching. 